Hello everybody, welcome back to another Surf Ball video. Today I'm going to be talking about adorable animals for literally no specific reason whatsoever. Except for the fact that I just love cute, adorable animals. So anyways, yeah, I think birds are very adorable. Let's see, we got like, oh gosh, not the triple shots. Not actually shooting at me. Oh no, that'd be tragic. Just stand completely still. Thank you. <laughs> Why do you stand still? Alright, anyways. So, um, yeah. Birds, let's see here. Actually, you know what? We're gonna start from, like, the bottom of the list and go up. Let's see here. We gotta do that S tier, F tier thing. Except I'm talking about cute animals, so absolutely nothing shall be on F tier. Uh, let's see here. We got... We got pigs. Pigs are absolutely adorable. I'm totally not going to be basing this off Minecraft animals. Anyways, so, oh my gosh, and already I'm falling into the void. Actually, if I was doing that, I'd probably start with cows, because pigs are cuter than cows. Pigs are so adorable, and I don't think they get enough attention on the cuteness ometer, cuteometer, or whatever. So... Yeah, pigs are adorable, and half the time they make adorable sounds. And all they want to do is just chill around and sit in cold mud all day. Like, that's amazing. That's a, that's an amazing life to live. It's beautiful. I feel like pigs don't have to be worried about, like, anything, except for surviving, which everything has to worry about, so... You know... <laughs> But I mean, like, if you have a pet pig, that pig doesn't have to worry about anything. That's what I mean. But, you know. Anyways, so, let's see here. Next we got birds. Birds are absolutely adorable. Probably S tier. They're pretty high up, I, I have to say. Birds are absolutely... Oh my gosh. Wait, no! I used two double dumps. That's tragic and sad. And a triple shot, which was completely useless. But, yeah, birds... Um... They're cute and adorable. I have three double jumps left. But I'm a bird, so I can fly. Oh yeah, wait, do I have a biased opinion? Because I I am a bird. My skin is a bird. I'm kidding. Well, I mean it is, but, you know. It doesn't mean I have a biased opinion. Maybe it's biased because I used to have birds. But in my defense, they're very cute. They're adorable. Pretty much every single animal I'm going to be saying is just going to be S tier. Because I'm... I just can't say it's anything lower, because they're just so cute and adorable. We, For some reason, I've just been getting recommended all these adorable little fox shorts. Like, it's just people playing with their pet fox, and sometimes pet fox is... Oh gosh. <laughs> Oh goodness, he's trying to repulse her. Ah, he continues trying to repulse her. This is not good. To so have one triple shot, oh gosh. But yeah, in my opinion, foxes are absolutely adorable as well. They're so cute and fluffy, and sometimes they also make absolutely adorable noises. But anyways, soft GG. That was, that was a good fight. Sweat and bullets, I guess, but, you know, I, I guess I just had to focus on what I was doing instead of talking about cute animals. How can you focus when you're looking at, like, a cute little dog or something? That is, like, the best stress reliever. If you are upset and stressed out, just look at videos of, like, cute animals or something. Like, you know what I do whenever I'm sad? Sometimes I'll go up to my dog and just... Hello, dog. I pet you now. Yes, very many pets. Pet, pet, pet. Because you are my pet. So get pets. And that's what I absolutely love about these all these cute little animals. And sometimes, when I'm watching these cute little animal videos, sometimes there's baby animals, and they're like so tiny and adorable, and they can like fit in your hand. And then, obviously, birds can always fit in your hand. Well, depending on what kind of bird. If it's like a toucan, you gotta have a pretty strong hand. But, you know, you can still fit a toucan in your hand. You can fit, like, the majority of birds in your hand. I don't 
I don't think there is a bird that you can't just like have it just at least sitting on your arm. But, like parakeets, I used to have parakeets. My bird skin is a parakeet. It's based off of a parakeet made by Kata Animations. She's absolutely amazing. Anyways, uh, if I can remember, I'll leave her in the description because you know this, she's my cousin. She made my skin. My skin is amazing. Anyways, so yeah, parakeets. You can put them on your finger, and they well sometimes if they let you. But yeah, you can like hold them on your finger. It is so adorable. At least my parakeets, you could. And they were like better trained. <laughs> and then they had babies, but since the babies literally lived with you know the domestic parents, they also were very domestic. So you know you could pretty much just play with all of the birds. So yeah, our parakeets were absolutely amazing. Now we have a dog, but I have to say cats are cute too. Alright, I'm not, I'm not gonna say the whole cat person, dog person thing, because first of all, I'm kind of more of a dog person, but I'm allergic to cats and dogs. Dogs are always so playful and energetic, and obviously, as you know, I'm very playful and energetic, of course. <laughs> so, yeah, I'm just saying, maybe I'm a bit more of a dog person, but, but cats, cats are good too. Cats are cool too, okay? Cats, birds, guinea pigs, all of that. Also guinea pigs. Guinea pigs are adorable. Also for some reason I've been getting recommended videos of capybaras, and capybaras are adorable, and I think that wasn't even a question. Everybody already knew. Capybaras, yeah, those things are adorable. This guy AFK. Iron golems. Iron golems are pretty cute pets too. They uh, help you and your villagers. They just like kill zombies and stuff. You can make iron farms, but why would you want to do that to your poor pets? I don't know what I'm saying. Oh gosh. Okay, let's not let's not get distracted, I guess. Shh. I don't know what happened. Oh. Rip. I was wondering if that actually did land on him or not, because Oh well. Anyways, so yeah. The capybars, they're absolutely adorable, but there's one problem, is that they were too adorable. My brother wanted one, and guess what happened? We, we didn't get one, but that but he still wants one, or he wanted one. I don't know if he wants one anymore, but but they're very expensive. Like, not, not just buying a capybara in general, just like the maintenance. Apparently you have to have like this huge pool for them. We don't, we don't have a pool. I don't think we're gonna get one. Especially just for a capybara, but you know, it would be an amazing pet, but we already have a cute little dog here, and her name is Gracie, and I'm sure you've heard about her before, if you like know me in real life, or just, just seen a video where I talked about her. I don't, that wasn't my fault. No, don't be mad at me. No, no, don't, oh, oh he's shooting arrows at me. Wait, I didn't make you fall into the void. <laughs> kidding. I, I guess that was technically me, because I'm his opponent, but that's not the point. <laughs> but yeah, that is a thing. People are like, do you want to be friends? And I'm like, it's a 1v1. Why would we be friends? Who, who are we going to be friends against? Are we just going to sit here for 10 minutes just looking at each other? And then bam, tie game as it ends. I guess that might be what they're thinking. But yeah, I think dogs are absolutely adorable. Cats are still absolutely adorable. But anyways, now we're gonna... I'm, I'm talking about my rodent opinion, because rodents... I think... I don't know, I mean like mice. Those are rodents, I guess. And mice are adorable, and sometimes I see them in the wild. And they're absolutely adorable. They're just so tiny. And they have like these cute little faces and whiskers and all that good stuff. But yeah, mice are adorable. Rats are adorable. Uh, guinea pigs, adorable. Hamsters, adorable. I used to have a pet hamster, and it was amazing. And after, I was like, hamsters don't get enough attention. I always hear people talking about guinea pigs, but but then I learned, oh, guinea pigs are absolutely adorable, and they're just these cute little chubby boys. But yeah, hamsters apparently do get talked about a lot too. I just didn't know about it because I was like two when I had a hamster. Not literally two, but you know. Very young. 
Are you out of triple shots, or can you just not use triple shots? Or are you left clicking with your bow and nothing's happening? All's a possibility. Maybe. Except for that last one. I have no clue. Rip. Alright, GG's and all that good stuff. Oh uh, yes, I had very good time talking about pets and imagining them in my head. For example, every time I was talking about a guinea pig, I was thinking about a guinea pig. Every time I was talking about a bird, I would think of my birds. And I, I have bird skin, so every time I'd hit F5, bam, I see a bird. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'll see you guys in the next one, and goodbye.